All right, everybody, I apologize for the glare here. I tried to get rid of it, but I don't think there's much I can do about it. But I thought really quickly I'd go over the last problem from the Try It On Your Own. From, this was from Monday's assignment. Um, just so you can get an idea of where that was going. And they were trying to set you up with essentially an arithmetic and a geometric uh, uh, sequence here. So they had you set up with the superwash and the power wash. They, uh, they set it up in a way that the super was the arithmetic and the power was the geometric. And they both had the, the initial pressure of 50 PSI, but the super, so you had your first term here was 50, and for the power, the first term was also 50. But the difference being uh, that with the super wash, you're going up by 80 PSI every second, and it's always going to be that constant increase of 80, whereas over here on the geometric side, on the power wash, you're going up by 20%. Now don't forget to include the original uh, 100%. When you have a 20% increase, technically that's a, by a factor of 1.2 or 1.20 in this case. And then any given term in the sequence could then be defined in the arithmetic sequence, any given term, again using that explicit uh, <clears throat> formula would be that first term 50 plus 80 times n minus 1, whereas over here on the geometric, any given term in the geometric would be again equal to that first term of the geometric sequence, but now that 1.20 to a power of n minus 1. So what this allows us to do is they said, all right, after 20 seconds, he wants to see which one of these power washers, power washers will have the greatest uh, pressure. So if I'm going to scroll down so you can see here. So after 20, now again, each term would be how much pressure built up at that point. So in this case, we're trying to find that 20th term, meaning after 20 seconds, what's the pressure that's been built up. So we take our 50, and in this case, 20 minus 1 is going to be 19. And we find out that after 20 seconds, the uh, superwash is up to 1,570 PSI. Whereas the power wash, its 20th term, again, is going to be that 50 times 1.20. But again, n minus 1, or 20 minus 1 is 19. Uh, you do the math, crunch that out through your calculator. Obviously not doing that one in your head. And 1597.4 PSI. So it'd be nice if you were somewhere in writing to put, you know, after 20 seconds, the power wash will accumulate 27.4 more PSI uh, than the super wash. Therefore, Kevin should purchase the power wash if he wants to go ahead and have the most powerful washer after 20 seconds.